Recently, there was a text message that was passed around about the ghost experience of a flight attendant working for a local airplane company. The person involved in the said incident happened to be a friend of my neighbor who also worked as a flight attendant for a different airline. From what I understood, they were classmates in college. My friend is now working in a hotel in Dubai. According to my friend, this was the story. It was one of those usual quiet nights at the airport. The flight attendant, whose name is George, began checking the cabin before takeoff. There were four cabin crews in that airplane. Just like the other nights, they performed a pre-flight safety demonstration. They were supposed to monitor the passengers as they instruct them on the use of seat belts and oxygen masks, the location of emergency exits and emergency floor lighting and other precautions to take before takeoff and landing. George was assigned to narrate over the public address system while her colleagues, standing up in the aisles, performed the live briefing. While speaking, George thought she saw someone coming out from the lavatory at the other end of the cabin. It was the shadow of a woman which moved frantically towards one of the seats at the back. She never bothered to ask her colleagues about this because she was in the middle of something important. Flight attendants usually conduct cabin checks every 20 to 30 minutes, especially during night flights, even though the whole trip would only take an hour. While checking the passengers, a woman approached George and told her, Please remind my husband to take his heart pills. He's in business class seat 8C. George assured the woman that she would. After takeoff, she went towards the man in 8C. Sir, remember to take your heart pills. The man was shocked at this. How did you know I have a heart condition? He asked her. Your wife told me to remind you, George said. The man suddenly burst into tears. Is there something wrong, sir? George asked curiously. My wife's dead, the man said, shaking. Her body is in this plane, and I'm taking her home to bury her. <laughs>